Stephen Wayland is a 20-year-old WIU student who hopes to represent a large portion of Macomb's population, college students. Just really being able to represent the students and giving them that voice, um, I think would benefit students greatly, uh, benefit the city as well. Um, it would open up a lot of avenues and give a lot of opportunities to students that they've never had before. Wayland received 17 votes for second ward alderman in the February election. His opponent, incumbent Kay Hill, received 16. Wayland says that the city told him after the election that he needed 50% of the vote plus one more vote to actually win. But he says the city hasn't shown him any paperwork to prove that. Regardless if I get the position or not, um, it was a great honor to be able to even run for the position. However, I do feel confident that if I have to go to another election that uh, I'll win that election as well. The Illinois Liberty Justice Center out of Chicago saw Wayland's situation. He says the legal team is helping him possibly bring this to court. Nobody wants this situation to go there um, or beyond at all. Unfortunately, it, it's come to that point where one of the only remedies that we could pursue would be um, involving the courts. We spoke with Hill and McDonough County Clerk Gretchen DeJanes by phone. Both said the issue is out of their control. Jeff Monlock, KHQA News, Macomb.